there are men and women driven by passion, committed to find happiness and meaning. They strive to better our lives and make us aspire to help others. They are visionaries. They advocate events, ideas, technological innovations that make significant shifts in our thinking. To make a better future for us, they pursue game-changing inventions that make us change the way we think, we live, we carry our lives, the way we see things. We ask ordinary people about their ideas and what they believe are game-changers. Journey with us as we tell stories of these visionaries and their game-changers. A great idea can get you ahead of the game, but a visionary concept can be a game-changer. I'm Albi Benitez and this is Game Changer. In this episode of Game Changer, from this to this, how lead technology is making things brighter in so many fields, especially in billboard advertising. Meet 15-year-old Amin Hataman, the so young, so talented inventor of the biodegradable grocery bag, and making the world smaller with the evolution of the voice over internet protocol or VOIP. If the 20th century was lit by the incandescent light bulb, the 21st century will be illuminated by LED technology. LED bulbs are brighter and longer lasting. And because they consume much less electricity, it is much loved by green advocates. From lights, and television sets to advertisements, concert backdrops, and public service announcements. LED or light emitting diode technology is everywhere. LEDs are called light emitting diodes. Basically, these are semiconductors na if you put through a current and a voltage, it will light up. And depending on the semiconductor that you use, it will either shine uh, red, blue, or green. From its initial discovery in 1907 by Henry Joseph Round, and subsequent developments that brought electroluminescence in red, blue, green, and white lights, to the show stopping organic LED or OLED technology of today, the LED has indeed gone a long way. Making TVs cheaper and cheaper, pwede mo nang gawin into bigger and bigger screens. It became now a possible tool for marketers to replace posters. And now, nakita natin si EDSA, puro billboard, dumadami na yung mga TVs. You can show text, you can play videos. So it's a game changer because you, there's a now a bigger tool set and play set for marketers and brand people to interact with their customers. But before these, there were these. Benji Sagmit of BM Sagmit Enterprises recalls how in the 1970s and 80s, billboards were simply hand-painted. Ang hawa kong sine is 86 Jetta. Isang gabi lang namin binibihisan yung mga sine yun. Aros 90% ng local films sa amin nagpapagawa. Regal, Seiko, Viva, FLT, Tagalog Ilang Ilang Production. They had both local and international clients. Though the competition was stiff, Benji said their A-game brought them to the top. Yung proseso niyan, yung hand-painted, is frame, kahoy. Tapos, lalagyan mo ng katsya. Tapos, nang i-sketch niya, yung sketcher na tinatawag. Pag may sketch niya yan, is yung pintor na gagawa ng mukha. But as Philippine cinema slowly lost its luster in the 1990s, so did their advertising business. Halos 99% talaga nawala. Ang totoo, ang asosasyon namin, 25. Ako na lang natitirang buhay na gumagawa ng ganyan. Hand-painted billboards became a dying form of art and advertising platform. Today, BM Sagmit Enterprises is the only advertising company that still produces them. William Encinares has been with the Sagmits since he was a kid. Hindi kagaya dati na talagang marami kami sa paggumagawa kami at mas maganda pa ang ano hinigita namin nun. But they learned to cope with the changing times. They turned to tarpaulin printing for the business to survive. With hand-painted billboards fading into the background, 
tarpaulins took the spotlight in outdoor advertising. It evolves into digital printing, which is uh, what we call photographic billboard. Tarpaulins, as static advertisements, were easier and faster to reproduce. With the tarpaulins, we can immediately multiply the images in as many as you want, and the computer will just have to print it. But as technology improved, tarpaulins, like the hand-painted billboards they replaced, are slowly being replaced by the next game changer, LED technology. Globaltronics Incorporated is said to be the first to introduce this digital advertising innovation to the Philippines. Uh, we brought in the first digital signages uh, from abroad and now we're the, considered the pioneer and uh, acknowledged leader. Though a bit more costly, LED ads are a quantum leap from the static images of tarpaulins. The LED is also more eco-friendly. It has no toxic elements. Compared to traditional incandescent light bulbs and compact fluorescent lights, LED uses less energy to produce the same amount of light. In fact, it saves up to 95% energy, losing only 5% in heat. And it can last up to 10 times longer. Altogether, this results in huge savings on utility costs. LED advertising began with a single or double lines like a crawler. We soon brought in the full video LED. For a digital LED, you can have full videos, you can do 3D videos, and it's very dynamic. It's going to run the whole day. It's very visual. The message of advertisements may not have changed, but the medium certainly has. In our case, we're a digital storyteller. So an ad is always the concept. So if you tell the story in the best way possible, if it's very visual, if it's very compelling, then that's an effective ad. Aside from advertising, LED technology has become a game changer in various applications as well. It's really a game changer sa lahat ng companies ngayon. Who would want to upgrade outdoor applications for LED is uh, when it comes to LED billboards. That's for the LED advertising. We have actually uh, mobile trucks, mobile LED trucks that you can use for elections, for concerts, for mini parties or gathering. For the indoor, we are the exclusive partner of Philips here in the Philippines. We distribute commercial display screens, which you can see on retail stores, fast food chains, of course, uh, big malls. Now. LED is used for such simple tasks as finding your way inside a mall, to complicate adventures like 3D art installations. Yes, the art has come full circle. Pagalingan talang sa creativity, kasi for these screens you can make your content 3D. You can make your content uh, for, because of the system. You can make it like Kinect, uh, you can interact with the TV. Right now, may ginagawa kami it's, uh, for a mall, pero you can actually change your clothes without you going inside the dressing room. LED has leveled up so many things in so many ways. Like in menus in restaurants, in company portfolios, and even in meetings and planning. Mobile advertisements are also made possible through LED-laden trucks. With more dynamic backgrounds, concerts have become an entirely new experience altogether. Events are more fun with interactive displays that wow and engage the participants. In the future, nakikita ko is see-through na. See-through na yung mga screens ngayon, and then you can actually remote all the content. Yung, it's like the Iron Man thing na you, you move it around, testing pa lang nila, but it's, meron na siya. Probably a 3D billboard. Na mismo ang pag nakita mo, parang lumalabas na sa screen. Indeed, the possibilities seem endless with LED technology. With the fusion of creativity and technology, it is exciting to see where it would take us. It is in places far away from the glare of the billboards where the impact of LED technology would be greatly felt. In remote areas, Tiny solar power sources can now light up multiple LED bulbs, making lives and the future much brighter. Meet 15-year-old Amin Hataman, the so young, so talented inventor of the biodegradable grocery bag. 
So who or what is a game changer? Game changers are things, ideas, or they are people who put forth pioneering concepts that change the way things are made, the way we do things, or even the way we think. We'll discover the most enterprising people, seek and encourage potential trailblazers, and take a peek into the minds of game changers. Midas Hotel and Casino, a contemporary, design-led lifestyle hotel in the majestic hub of Manila with fabulous views of sunset on the bay. Midas offers designer amenities and guest rooms and suites, supreme restaurant options for sumptuous enjoyment, event studios for corporate meetings and vows, and a casino with world-class gaming. Here at Midas, we make days into moments. Sparkling creativity, it's stylemanship by Midas. Are you a game changer? Do you know somebody who is? Are there ideas or concepts that are changing lives in your community? Simply click her website and help us spread these inspiring stories.